Afra Benz, the widow rancher or the history of bacon in Virginia, unfolds against the backdrop of colonial Virginia, blending historical events with fictional elements. Set during Bacon's rebellion in the late 17th century, the play navigates the complexities of power, loyalty, and societal norms within the context of a tumultuous time in American history. Central to the narrative is the character of the widow ranter, a strong-willed and independent woman who challenges the traditional roles expected of women in her society. Ben uses the widow ranter as a vehicle to explore gender dynamics and the limitations imposed upon women during that era. The widow's defiance of societal norms, her assertiveness, and her ability to lead and command respect from men challenge the conventional expectations of femininity in the play. Moreover, the play delves into the theme of power and authority. The widow ranter, despite her gender, possesses a considerable amount of power and influence. Her control over her estate and her strategic maneuvers within the political landscape showcase her as a formidable figure, subverting the notion of male dominance. This portrayal challenges the traditional power structures of the time, where women were typically relegated to submissive roles. Ben also uses the character of Bacon to explore the complexities of leadership and rebellion. Bacon represents the voice of the people, fighting against the oppressive forces of colonial authority. His rebellion against the colonial governor, Berkeley, serves as a focal point in the play. Through Bacon's character, Ben examines the blurred lines between heroism and rebellion, shedding light on the complexities of challenging established authority for the greater good. The play's setting in colonial Virginia allows Ben to explore themes of colonization and its impact on indigenous populations. While the focus remains on the political turmoil between the settlers and the colonial government, Ben subtly highlights the injustices faced by Native Americans. The interactions between the settlers and the indigenous people serve as a reminder of the consequences of colonization and the conflicts that arise from the clash of cultures. Ben's writing style in The Widow Ranter is characterized by its wit, satire, and sharp social commentary. Through clever dialogue and nuanced characterizations, she critiques societal norms and challenges the status quo. The play's blend of history and fiction provides a platform for Ben to dissect complex themes while entertaining her audience. In conclusion, Afra Ben's The Widow Ranter or The History of Bacon in Virginia is a multifaceted exploration of gender, power dynamics, rebellion, and colonialism. The play's portrayal of strong female characters, examination of power structures, and critique of societal norms contribute to its enduring relevance. Ben's skillful storytelling and incisive commentary make the play a compelling piece that transcends its historical context, resonating with themes that remain pertinent in contemporary society.